Port of Felixstowe is the biggest container port. It carries over 40% of all container traffic in and out of the country. It sits within the Stour and Orwell estuary, which is one of the most highly designated environmental areas. It's got just about every environmental designation that you can think of. The Haven Authority does a lot of work to make sure that the impacts of the port don't affect any of the wildlife. The reason the birds come to this estuary is because the mudflats are extremely productive for invertebrate life, so there's an awful lot for them to eat. What you would see visiting the estuary in particular are wading birds. Some of those include Avocet, which of course is the emblem of the RSPB, which at one time was highly threatened and is now doing very well. The benthic work that we do, so that's sampling things which live in the mud, we found there is no particular change over the last 15 years. The food sources for the birds are holding steady. There were concerns when the channel was last deepened in 2000 that we would be trapping silt in the harbour and then taking it back out to sea rather than it washing up onto the mudflats. So one of the things which we do, some of the material which we dredge actually gets taken upstream in small dredges and put back into the water column. Here at Shotley and Trimley we have used material to create extra salt marsh and extra mud flats in areas which has also provided protection to the sea walls. It helps to act as a wave break and reduce the maintenance costs of the sea wall itself. The Haven Authority is a part of the Stour and Orwell Estuary Management Group which is a group of many organisations which come together to look at the sustainable use of the estuary. The mission statement of the Harwich Haven Authority is to protect and enhance the estuary for all of its uses and so by working with all of our environmental regulators and with the port operators it means that we can have successful ports operating in a sensitive environment without any detriment to the local area. I've lived here all my life. I'm an old Harwich boy. In fact, I'm the sixth generation of my family to work on the port in Harwich. I think they'd be very pleased to know that Harwich is still here and we are looking after the area well.